over one million Zionists have decided to leave and not return to the so-called State of Israel since May 2021 until now. This is as per Ida'ot Ahranot, one of the leading newspapers in the Zionist state. And right now, over 40% of their population is seriously considering to emigrate from their terrorist state and not come back to it. And over 78% of adults are thinking and urging their younger ones to study abroad and to start life elsewhere. Whenever you feel helpless, whenever you feel down, remember that at the end, victory is to those who believe. And what is happening now in Palestine has been prophesied over 1400 years ago. When free, please read chapter 17, verses 4 to 7 of the Holy Quran, Surah Al Isra. The last verse says, فَإِذَا جَاءَ وَعْدُ الْآخِرَةِ لِيَسُوءُوا وُجُوهَكُمْ وَلِيَدْخُلُوا الْمَسْجِدَ كَمَا دَخَلُوهُ أَوَّلَ مَرَّةِ وَلِيُتَبِّرُوا مَا عَلَوْ تَتْبِيرًا In those verses, Allah SWT talks to those Zionists and tells them, look, you have been given wealth and strength over mankind twice. The first was during the time of Damukh Danassar, before Christ's time. And we all saw what Damukh Danassar did to them when they led astray the world. He basically destroyed them and took over the Holy Land. And slowly that land became where Christ, peace be upon him, became a prophet and spread the true word of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala after they were led, being led astray not following what Prophet Moses, peace be upon him, teach them. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about the second promise, which is what we are witnessing now. He says that they will, be, they will have a full control of this world through their power, through their strength, through their numbers, through their ideologies. However, those who believe at the end will, will be the victorious ones. And after Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala shows to the whole world their bad and ugly face, the true believers will be victorious and will enter Jerusalem as those who believed entered before. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make me, you, and all of us, one of them, free Palestine. Assalamu alaikum.